27 is f of x is equal to 2 minus x over 3. Okay? I'm going to make that look a little better. Okay? Because first of all, we have to grab, we have to um, find the inverse. Is that what it said? Graph the function. So graph, find, inverse, and then graph again. A T. Okay? Well, is this linear or nonlinear, first of all? Linear or nonlinear? Come on. What's the exponent on the x? Is it 1? Yeah. Or is it different than 1? It's a 1. Okay? The exponent on the x is a 1. Therefore, this is a linear function. Okay? If it's linear, what's the inverse going to be? People. If I take the graph and it's a line and then I flip the paper, does it change from being a line? No. no. So it's going to be a line. Woo! Wake up, please. Okay. I want to write this in a lot better way. This is y. So this is y. This should be written as one-third negative, right, x plus 2. Now, why would I write it like that? Easier for what? What's this? That's the Gauss equation, right? What does it do for us? Tells us how to graph it. Tells us how to graph it. Okay? So I've got M is equal to one third negative and B is equal to two. So if I'm gonna graph this young lady. I almost said a word I'm not supposed to say. So uh, I'm gonna start at two. One, two. Right? And then <clears throat> I'm going to go down one, <clears throat> rise, <clears throat> over run. I'm going to go down one and right three. Okay? Or I could go up one and left three. Either way, I've got a line. Right? Then I want to be able to flip it, remember? I'm going to take this piece and then go up here. I'm going to flip it. So it's still going to go through this point, right? It's just how does it go through that point? Right? It's not a perpendicular, is it? It's flipped. So we got to flip this around. So x is equal to negative one-third y plus 2. And then we got to solve for y, right? So, all right, minus 2. I got x minus 2 equals negative 1 third y. How do I get rid of that negative 1 third? Multiply by what? The reciprocal. But negative 1 third, right? Because I got to make it positive. Or well, not 1 third, 3 over 1, right? So that means everybody on the block gets that, 3 over 1. Alright, so we got negative 3x minus plus 6 is equal to y. Okay, that means that 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, oh, maybe it doesn't go to that point. Right? Oh, it went to that point, that's right. Sorry about that. So, uh, it's going to go up 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and then we're going to go what? Down 3, right 1, and there it is. And that's the inverse. 
And I can double check that. Right? If I take this line and I do this. Uh oh. Do this. There you go. Bam! And I gotta go up. Bam! There it is. It's our line. Right? Yay, yeah, team. Easy, easy peasy. Okay. Um, that's 27. I wanted to do the other one. Are we out of time?